there's some pieces where, you know, there, because we're now I'm doing a lot of contemporary music, where there's one moment that just might not work at all. And we just, you, like, it, you, eight out of 10, it works. And nine, you know, maybe nine out of 10, but there's that one chance that it just might not, it might just all go <laughs> and spin out of control. And uh, it usually doesn't happen. And when it does, I just conduct in time as much time as possible. There's usually a lot of mixed meter stuff. Mm -hmm. And I just conduct as much time as possible and just drag us to the end of the thing. I've actually had somebody skip, I had somebody skip two systems when I was conducting um, Stravinsky, uh, Stravinsky, Dumbarton Oaks. So I she skipped two systems and this flute solo just appeared out of nowhere. I was like, beautiful, you know? And it's like, and I, and I, do, I, look, I heard the first note and I was like, whoa, this was two years ago. I was like, well, it looked like this. And I was like, <laughs> like, oh, these sonorities, nobody's, this is like, this could never happen again. And I was like, I looked at her and she looked at me like, I'm in the wrong spot, aren't I? I was like, yeah, you know, here, here we go. We are in the, um, two weeks ago, no, a month ago, I, we were playing a concert outside and we had clothespins, but I, we, didn't, we weren't, didn't have the right books, you know, and I watched the clarinet player's music, big, huge gust of wind, and I, the whole book went, poof, and she had a solo and she just looked at me and just made up the solo. Just like, boom, like, just like, ba ba da we did it all ba da 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 and I was like, you know, she put her instrument down, like, uh, all right. Got collected all of her music. And it, so there's some moments, there are things that happen, you know, that you have to just be, a, this will happen. This is live music. This is not a recording, you know. Even on the recording, some recordings, you could find this happening. You could hear, like, someone dropped something or, you know, whatever. So, so if all of a sudden your flute player is off by two systems that, and, you're, and things went off, how mm -hmm. do you get everyone back together mm -hmm. again? It depends. There are a couple ways. Everybody knows the music well, orally, so they could tell when it's not right. But you just get every, you get a couple people that are right, and you just go with them. And then at a big rehearsal number, you just go boom, and you hope that they jump. Or their next entrance, you just look at the person, you really connect with them, and go boom, and then you kind of like mouth the rhythm of everything. Yeah, ba da, ba dee, ba da, ba da. You kind of like sing with them what they're supposed to be doing, and then you'll you'll know. Yeah. You know. I mean, that's rare. But that's a kind of been my solution. I don't know. This is the thing, actually, we didn't talk a lot about in conducting school. What happens when the thing falls apart? There's a great L.A. Philharmonic story. Uh, Jeff Reynolds, my teacher, told me where uh, they're playing a new piece. There's a premiere, you know, and uh, it's a big kind of spectral thing. It's like very hazy. And uh, half the orchestra somehow gets lost. Like it's just like some big thing happens where a cr crucial element comes in in the wrong place. There's some cues or something. The thing gets, gets off. And the conductor, he, all the musicians are looking up. You know, the conductor, I forget who it was, is conducting, maybe an assistant or somebody younger, is conducting, and he just goes like this. Like, you know, he's kind of like this. And then he just goes like this. And everybody, the whole ensemble gets quieter and quieter and quieter and quieter. And he just goes like this. And it's not the music. He's just conducting. And they all get quieter and quieter. And then he goes like this. R. Boom! You know, and they and they all you know and everybody, boom! You know and then the piece and you know I think the piece was even received well. well this is live music. Things occur. Yeah. This is like uh, this. This will occur. So worst case scenario is that the, the conductor has to say something. Yeah, I mean it's very rare. I think that's like uh, I don't think I've ever said that in a performance. R. I don't think I've ever done that. But J. J. Yeah. <laughs> Triple. You know. Double. M.